What's up guys, David here, and the iPhone XS Max and the Galaxy Note 9 are both really great smartphones that each have their own unique set of advantages. So in this two-part phone buff style video series, we're gonna be looking at a bunch of reasons why each of these phones could be considered better than the other. In this video, we're taking a look at why the iPhone can be considered better. And in the next video, which I'll be linking for you down below, we're gonna be doing the same exact thing with the notes. After watching both videos, be sure to vote for which phone you think has the stronger reasons. But with that said, let's go ahead and get right into it. Applying a screen protector to your phone isn't always easy and rarely perfect. So the folks over at Spigen created a better way to do it with guaranteed alignments using a custom design tray. Big thanks to Spigen for sponsoring today's episode, where with EasyFit, you can install their high quality screen protector in three easy steps. Just peel off the protective film, put the custom fit tray over your phone, and then simply press down to get a perfect alignment every time. The EasyFit is available for all the new iPhones from the iPhone 8 and 8 Plus to the iPhone XS and XR, so click on that link down below and get your iPhone the protection it deserves. Reason number one, Taptic Engine. The vibration motor on the iPhone offers a much wider range of frequencies than the one on the Note, so when you interact with a certain thing on the screen, the phone responds in a way that feels a lot more natural. Two, lock screen privacy. On the iPhone, other people won't be able to just pick up your phone and read your missed notifications like text messages or emails. With the phone only showing that sensitive information on the lock screen after it verifies that it's you that's looking at it with face ID. Three, intuitive interface. You've probably heard that the iPhone is more intuitive to use, and just one of the many examples of this is looking at the way folders work on each phone. So both phones show you the apps inside of a folder before you tap on them. But the difference is, on the iPhone, the apps show up exactly how you'd expect them to with the arrangement in the folder matching the arrangement of the folder icon. Whereas on the Notes, the apps don't appear where you expect them to with the arrangement of the folder icon being completely completely different from the arrangement in the folder itself. Again, this is just one of the many examples that ultimately add up to a more intuitive experience on the iPhone. Four. Apple stores. If you have an issue with your iPhone, like a broken screen for example, you can just walk into one of the hundreds of Apple stores around the world and get the issue resolved usually on the same day. Reason number five, Wi-Fi password sharing. If you have your friends come over to your house and you both have iPhones, you can share your Wi-Fi password with them automatically with a single tap by just having them try to connect. You'll get a prompt on your phone asking you if you want to allow them to connect, and without actually having to give them the password itself, they'll be connected automatically. Six, continuity. If you own a Mac or an iPad, the iPhone has the advantage of allowing you to move seamlessly between your devices. You can do things like answering a phone call on your iPad to starting a hotspot using your iPhone on your Mac. 7. Complete Phone Backup If you get a new iPhone, whether it's a replacement or an upgrade, getting all of your things transferred over is easy via iCloud or iTunes. And unlike the backup options on Android phones, you get all of your data, including individual app data and login information. 8. Spotlight Search with a simple swipe down from the home screen, you access Spotlight Search, which lets you search for anything, whether it's an app on your phone, an app on the App Store that you want to download, a location in Maps, or even websites that match your search all in one convenient place. 9. iMessage iMessage not only lets you send messages securely with end-to-end -end encryption, but it also has fun little features like expressive messages and Animoji, along with more useful features like being able to send messages across all of your devices. Reason number 10. Parental controls. Better parental controls with restrictions allow you to block content and actions through a password protected setting, meaning you can make sure that your kid isn't visiting any websites that they shouldn't be, and even have the option to prevent them from erasing browser history so you can monitor their activity. 11. Vibrate Switch The physical vibrate switch on the iPhone not only makes it easy to quickly put your phone on silent whether the screen is on or off, but it also acts as a visual cue, so you can tell if your phone is on vibrate or not with just a quick glance. 12. 
Longer support. Apple typically supports their phones with software updates for much longer than Samsung does. Case in point, the Galaxy S4, which was released in 2013, stopped receiving software updates in 2016. The iPhone 5S, on the other hand, also released in 2013, is still running on the latest version of iOS 12. 13. Usable screen real estate. The iPhone's display gives you more usable screen real estate than the Notes. This is because the iPhone isn't burdened with a navigation bar, allowing it to show you more content. And unlike the Notes' curved edges, the iPhone's thin bezels don't come at the cost of functionality or distortion when you're doing things like watching video. 14. Face ID we unlock our phones over 80 times a day, and with Face ID, those unlocks are much more ergonomic since you don't have to stretch your finger all the way up to reach a fingerprint scanner. And those unlocks are also more convenient since all you have to do is look at the phone, which is especially useful when you're authenticating in password protected apps. Reason number 15. Faster performance. As we saw in our Phone Buff Style speed test, the iPhone and its A12 Bionic chip is faster at not only loading up applications, but also at doing tasks within those applications like opening up a Word document or exporting a photo. 16. Fast OS updates. On the iPhone, you get updated to the latest version of iOS pretty much as soon as Apple releases it. Whereas on the Note, it usually takes at least a month before Samsung is able to push out a security fix and several months before they're able to push out a system upgrade. 17. Resale value. The iPhone tends to enjoy higher resale values than the Note, with right now the iPhone 8 Plus selling for an average of $559 used, while the Note is selling for only $417 used, meaning you'll get more money back when you eventually sell the iPhone. 18. Better apps. Generally speaking, app developers seem to prioritize iOS over Android, which means not only do apps and their respective app updates come to the iPhone first, but sometimes, particularly with games, apps never end up making their way over to Android and stay exclusive to the iPhone. 19. Accessory Ecosystem Similar to app developers, accessory manufacturers also prioritize for the iPhone, so if you want a sweet docking station, a camera lens case, or other cool accessories, you're much more likely to find it for the iPhone than you are for the Note. Reason number 20. 3D Touch the entire screen on the iPhone is pressure sensitive, which means just by applying a bit more pressure to the screen than you normally would, you can do things like previewing links in an app without actually having to leave the app, shooting a gun in a first person shooter game without needing a separate trigger button, and moving the cursor on the keyboard in any direction without having to stretch your fingers up to the cursor itself. 21. Better text input. When you take 3D Touch's cursor control with iOS's drag and drop features and sprinkle in some shake to undo, inputting and editing text becomes a lot easier to do on the iPhone compared to the Note. 22. True Tone Display With True Tone, the iPhone automatically adjusts the display to look the same regardless of the environment that you're in, giving you a more comfortable and consistent experience. 23. Tap to Top You can automatically scroll to the top of any screen by tapping on the status bar. This works system-wide in any app across the phone, and it's great for when you're really far down an email thread or a web page and you want to get to the top quickly without having to swipe down a bunch of times. 24. Privacy. In addition to the little visual cues you get when an app is using something like your microphone, because of their different revenue models, Apple has less of an incentive to collect your personal data, which explains why in some instances, Android phones have been found to collect almost 10 times more data on you than iPhones. And finally, reason number 25. Augmented Reality. The iPhone was built with augmented reality in mind, with it having not just the dual camera system on the back, but the true depth camera system on the front. Meaning, not only can you do things like play AR games on your coffee table, or get dimensions with virtual measuring tape, but you can also do things with third party apps like getting a 3D scan of your face to help you find the perfect pair of glasses. Okay, so those are the top 25 reasons why the iPhone could be considered better than the Notes. But remember, the word better is subjective, so be sure to watch the Notes version of this video, which will be linked for you down below in the description. Anyways, that is it for me in this video. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the very next episode.